Hi, it's Sue from the Unicorn Advisory, your trusted Kajabi expert with another Kajabi quick tip for you. Today, I'm talking about how your products are displayed to your students, as in what your library page looks like and how the products are ordered on this page. Now, sometimes when you get super busy in the back end in your side of Kajabi, it's really easy to forget what it might look like when your students actually log in. And if like me you have a lot of products even if you've got more than a few products it can be nice to order them in a way that makes sense and if you don't do this every time you make a new product it is just going to be added to the bottom of your list and there may be things that you want to appear first for example I like to put coaching products first so that they're easy and quick to access and because communities is new I've moved that one up as well but you might be wondering well how do I do that well well, there's ways that you can see your products in different orders. You can click through and sort them however you want. It's going to default to recently updated, but there's lots of different ways that you can do that. Library order, if you have it set to that, is a way to remember what is what in the library. But you can also come here to library sorting and actually move things around so they are exactly what you want. So if you do make a, a new product and you find that you can't see it on here, you might need to scroll all the way down to the bottom and then bring it all the way back up to the top so that um, it will show exactly where you want it to show in people's libraries particularly um, if you have a membership that has lots of individual mini courses or anything like that where you want to decide how things are going to appear in the library. Lucky, it's very, very easy. You can just get that and drag it around and put things exactly where you want, which is really nice. So you can do that. Um, one thing I would suggest is that you actually log in in an incognito window, ideally, so that you can see. So grant yourself offers or go and purchase offers so that you can log into the library page and you can see what your students are going to see. It's really, really important because otherwise, you may not have any idea what it's actually going to look like on the student end because you don't see it unless you actually log in to your Kajabi system as if you were a student. So we can see we've got these at the top. When I first came in here, they were all the way down the very, very bottom, these two offers here. Um, so yeah, just a reminder to move things around, put them in a logical order and get it just how you want. And when you do a few new products, you might need to come in and do it again because if you're not regularly logging into your own site, it is really easy to forget and they could end up all the way down the bottom. Well, that is your quick tip for today. If you would like more Kajabi help, please do subscribe to the channel or you can get quick tips directly to your inbox. Every weekday, I send one out. To get on that list, just go to theunicornadvisory.com slash quick tips and you'll get a dose of Kajabi inspo in your inbox every weekday. Sue from the Unicorn Advisory. See you next time.